Hi everyone, welcome to Data Science Online. This is a machine learning course and we are going to have an introduction session. So what are the topics that will be covered under this course? The first one will be data pre-processing and the second one will be supervised learning, classification algorithm, regression algorithm and association rules will be covered. And the next topic will be covered is unsupervised learning and the under unsupervised learning we will learn clustering algorithm dimensionality reduction or we call it as pca and the next one is semi supervised learning it is a combination of both supervised and unsupervised learning the next one we will cover is reinforcement learning and then the best approach for model selection it is how to fine tune the model and to get more accuracy and the last one we will cover is the deep learning. So what is machine learning? So it is the ability to learn without being explicitly programmed. Machine or the algorithm tends to learn from the past or the, from the data without being explicitly programmed to get an output. So that's what we are doing. And machine learning is a part of AI. So AI is a big umbrella. Under AI, we have machine learning and then the deep learning. Nowadays, we are getting a huge data from social media, media sites, and etc. etc. According to the prediction, by 2025, we will have around 160 zettabytes of data. That's why nowadays everyone are looking into Spark, Hadoop, and big data concept are too much growing in the market. And as there is an exponential growth in data, the industry is also growing by 2020. The one of the hard jobs will be data scientist. Now let's look into a real-time example. The first one is face detection. Both in Google and in Facebook, we are uploading images. And first time when we are uploading the images, it requests us to tag an image. So when we tag an image, it gets stored in the respective algorithms or in the database. And whenever we upload a new image, it automatically identifies the image automatically tags a name with the image so how does it happen it happens due to the machine learning previously we have provided the tag for the respective image so whenever a new image is added it goes and check with the tag and it understands that this particular image is referred to this tag and it pulls out so this is a machine learning algorithm the next one what we are going to look is speech recognition and speech to text in iOS and Android, you might have seen a mic symbol in the keypad. So what does it do? When you press the mic symbol and when you speak to the device, it recognizes your voice and your speech is converted into a text. How this happens? It happens due to the machine learning algorithms. Next one is the motion detection and gesture analysis. So one of the classic examples is Kinect which is a Microsoft Xbox. So it's a gaming device. There's no need of a physical controller to play a game. The user himself will be a controller for gaming. So it capture the image of the user and it converts the points and the gesture and their motion through which the gamer is able to play the game in Xbox. Some of the tech chains who are using machine learning is Amazon, as you know, there's a recommendation engine is there. Whenever we look into any product within Amazon, you automatically get a recommendation. It is based on machine learning. The next one is Netflix. Whenever you watch a movie, you get a recommendation for the next movie or the video. And then um, another biggest one is the LinkedIn. In LinkedIn, your profile is being shared within the network and this happens through the machine learning algorithms. Thank you for watching the video. In the next video, we will start coding.